Yo, what is up guys, it's your World More Tricks here, back with yet another mega, it feels amazing to say that, welcome to the video everybody, I know it's been so freaking long since I've last uploaded, I don't even know, like I think over 50 freaking days, which is the longest break I have taken on YouTube since I've started, I started in 2017, it is now 2021, okay, so yeah, Quite freaking insane, but I'm so excited and happy to be back. If you guys are indeed new to the channel, you're probably super confused, but decided to take a break. We're back at it though with some BTD content. Make sure y'all click that subscribe button and also drop a like for your boy for coming back to YouTube, okay? We're gonna be staying consistent with these uploads, okay guys? I just needed a break from YouTube altogether, from the game and whatnot. It was a lot on my mental health, okay? So it felt necessary that I had to take a break. I feel revived. I feel much better, okay? I'm just so happy to freaking be back, okay? We do have my pit free power-ups, okay? Which is something I don't necessarily prefer, uh, but it's fine, okay? Rakan is our first opponent in a game. Nah, we're not gonna be playing that, okay? But I've noticed that there has been so much stuff that has got, like, look, Shipwreck's a new map. Like, dude, I don't even freaking know this game anymore, man. <laughs> I've heard so much news, boys. Like, when I took a break, I also didn't really stay up to date with BTD content at all with, like, any other YouTubers or just, like, changes in the game and whatnot. But I've heard there's been a lot of changes, okay? I heard, like, Ninja Kiwi, like, partnered with another company or something. I'm not sure. Everything new that happened, make sure y'all comment down below so I know because I need your guys' help. Like, seriously, there has just been so many changes. Uh, but yeah, let's freaking get it, boys, okay? You already know, good and positive vibes, and we shall indeed win, okay? We're gonna be starting off with this bow here, so let's get that. It feels great to say that, okay? He's also, oh, he only has sets attacks. Okay, so Rakan does not look too good. He doesn't look like he has decent powers at all. So uh, this should be a pretty easy dub. Pretty easy dub to say the least, boys. We upgraded to the more bananas on our farm as well. Amazing. And uh, he didn't send us any balloons here. I'm not going to send him any balloons, I guess. I kind of just want to see how he plays this out because he used all three sets of his spikes. And since he also showed that power, that tells me that he probably has default powers, which, yeah, you're not going to get the win with that, bud, okay? But there he goes finally with a popping power tower on the map, which is the wizard. We're going to be sending him three sets of space pinks, okay? We just want to mainly force that wizard lightning upgrade on his side okay let's go for the plantation as well wonderful force the upgrade as well let's go okay dude i'm just getting so hyped for no freaking reason uh but yeah he's gonna be sending us like a few sets of pinks here okay I decide to upgrade to the grape shot here um and hopefully we'll be good with that okay it looks like we're consistently leaking not too many lives though we're still at 122 so that's not too bad i'm gonna end up greeting this here and going for another farm uh because it looks like yeah he's showing no signs of stopping that's all good okay i don't think it should be too big of a deal I'm gonna go for the more bananas even as well. Why not? Let's use the super eco boost as well because I forgot to use that. And then after that, we're gonna be going for another boat. Okay, definitely need some extra help because uh, we're already down to 101 lives. Okay, so a single boat with the grave shot cannot defend constant pinks. Okay, noted, noted, noted. I'm gonna try to go for a second plantation here because I think with the zero zero now we're fine. He should have sent us some space blacks. Those would be a lot more effective, but. Um, that's obviously a good thing for us if he's not doing that, okay? Uh, also, too, I've noticed a lot of you message me and reach out to me on Twitter, Instagram. Oh. I really appreciate you guys, okay? Like, thank you so much. I I'm so sorry, too, because I never let you guys, like, have an update or anything. I never released, like, a community post. Just a post in general about how I was doing. Some of you thought I was hurt. Some of you thought I was dead. Like, it, it was just actually insane, so... I really do apologize, okay? That was that was very, very wrong of me. And I should have let you guys know that I was taking a break. It kind of just happened, though. I kind of just didn't feel like uploading one day. And then that turned into a week. And then that turned into a month. And then so on and so forth. Uh, so, yeah. It was definitely an unplanned break. Uh, so, it kind of just happened. So, I do apologize, okay? We're all good here. Uh, but hopefully, you guys aren't too upset at me. I'm going to be sending him some Spacer Gym whites here because of course he's gonna have to upgrade in order to defend against those uh looks like he's gonna consistently leak to these if he does not upgrade and there he goes for uh the dragon breath upgrade on that okay so well done well done indeed i haven't even been using my powers either oh my gosh Boltrix, what are you doing man okay i am so freaking rusty boys uh but there we go with the super ego boost i think he might be all adding us i'm not sure he could have a broken power combination oh yes he is he is indeed boys okay yeah uh, so we're just going to go like this. Micro, you already know, is on freaking point. We're going to go for the damage boost as well. And that is an easy defend, okay? I mean, I wasn't really expecting too much from that guy. He didn't have too many farms and whatnot. Uh, but yeah, he's 100% dead to the regen rainbows here. And that's going to be an easy freaking victory. Let's go, 
Oh, boys, I know I'm so hyped over, like, the easiest win in the game, but who cares, man? It feels great to start off with a dub. First game back, GG's only. I will catch y'all in the next one. All right, boys, so we are back with a much better looking opponent, Naktar Bietz. That's probably pronounced wrong, but you already know if you know me, I cannot pronounce names, okay? Yeah, he definitely looks pretty good. Um, so I'm going to try our best. Be in our A game, and hopefully we can win. Shallow River, not the map that I prefer, so I'm going to wait until the last second to skip if he does not, and then we'll skip that. By the way, too, I tried uploading multiple freaking times over the course of this break. I just didn't like any of the videos or the content that I was producing. It just, like, didn't feel like I was being myself in them, uh, so I didn't want to upload content like that. It just, I don't know. It just didn't feel right with me. Uh, but now I feel good. I feel freaking actually fantastic. I've been consistently going to the gym. School has been great. I'm actually on break right now, so that's a huge relief. Uh, so I'm going to focus a little bit more on YouTube and getting back into the groove of that. Um, so yeah, I'm just freaking hyped, man. I'm just freaking hyped. We got cards. I love this map. Dart Wizard Farm is personally my go-to when I get another dub. Let's freaking get it, okay? We gotta be a little bit more like uh, aware of what's going on because I didn't like even use my Super Eka Boost like at the right times the last game. And that could have really costed us the game if that guy was a little bit better. So I'm gonna try to focus a little bit more. Focus up and uh, we should be good, okay? So let's go for this farm here. 18 seconds. Amazing. He is also farming. Good, good signs for sure. We're gonna be going for the Boar Bananas here, okay? And uh, then we can send him a little bit of eco. Oh, never mind. Okay, you know what? We're not going to send him any eco because he is starting off with the engineer. Okay. And uh, that tells me he's going Ninja NG most likely. And also, too, the 0-0 zero zero engineer is pretty good against, like, Space Blues and whatnot. I don't even think that would force an upgrade, to be honest with you. Uh, so, yeah, I'm just going to save up my money, go for this trip dart here so we don't leak too many lives to the eco that he sent us because I was also expecting that. And, yeah, looks like we're good against all of that. Wonderful. He upgraded anyway. Okay, so we have to send him a single balloon. To force the upgrades, he was going to upgrade anyway. That's a great thing, okay? I think on round five, I'm going to send this man constant space pink seed fatal lair within the AI. Um, and then we'll go from there, okay? We're going to be going for yet another triple dart as well. I'm going to put this bad boy on too close. This one's just going to be on first. And uh, we should be all good with that, okay? Yeah, we were indeed. Let's get it. He stopped pretty early. Um, so yeah, I kind of just want to put some pressure on his side because oh wait He did actually go for that plantation there. Hmm. Okay, both use the super eco boost at the same time I want to go back on what I said uh, just because he probably would be able to um, Afford upgrades and whatnot. I know space blacks are gonna be a lot more effective as well um, Yeah, okay, this is gonna be much better because he just went for that farm So yeah, let's send him a lot of space blacks here should be seeing consistent leaks here uh, we'll see how it goes, okay? Like I said, this guy is pretty good, and I am also rusty, so um, if we do happen to lose, which, you know, I'm confident that we can win, but, you know, you never know, I guess. <laughs> oh my, okay, but he is consistently leaking here, okay? Um, and also, he's chasing these balloons a little bit, so hopefully he does upgrade them a little bit more. It looks like he is awesome. Uh, Should have won with the Super Eco Boost, by the way, boys. Kind of forgot about that, okay? Not in the water at all, though. We're going to go for a more Bananas, and also a zero two. 2 Probably should have continued to send with this round 7 AI, but it's all good. Okay, we got him down to 120. Okay, so I guess I can't be mad. Cannot be mad at all. I'm going to use this Super Eco Boost at the start of round 8. Amazing. Okay, and there he goes actually for his too, so he must have forgot as well. There we go for that second plantation finally. He shouldn't be going for any more farms. He could though. We'll have to see what he does. I'll be at Ninja NG. Okay, this is a shorter map though. That's the one that we got going for us. Uh, because Ninja NG does tend to struggle sometimes on shorter maps, in my opinion. Uh, so we might be able to catch the dub with that. He did also go for another farm. Like I said, he probably shouldn't have done that. Um, hmm, what do we do here? I'm saying we're just... Ooh, that wasn't enough yellows for me to actually glue Storm, boys. I should not have done that. But uh, what we're going to do at him is we're going to send him a little bit of a rush here on round 10. Because he has no lead popping power, technically. And he's going to have to use a lightning bolt. Okay, so that's good to know that he has that power. I, I did not expect that. Okay, so good to know. Good to know indeed. I'm going to go for this third plantation here. Kind of greed this a little bit. Uh, he's probably not going to be liking that. And eventually, oh, oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Okay, so both of our glue storms are out the drain. Oh my gosh, I probably should not have used that. Okay, and there he goes with another Super Eco Boost. Yeah, let me use mine as well. He's going and he's my battery. No way. No freaking way. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, I wanted to send the shock face because I absolutely adore that strategy. That's what I should have went, man. That's what I should have went with. 
Oh my gosh. Okay, so that kind of sucks to see. Uh, ooh, okay, so this is actually going to be kind of tough a little bit. I might have to boost that, actually. So, yeah, I'm going to boost that just to be safe. I was really not ready, and also I did go for that Republic there, uh, which was pretty expensive. And uh, he's also being quite aggressive towards us, which tells me he doesn't have too much money. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to go for a, another plantation here, which is really greedy. But he did go for another farm, so hopefully he doesn't have too much money to rush me. Uh, yeah, okay, so... If we wanted to send him like camo leads, we could, which that would hurt him, but that's going to be quite expensive. And all he has to do is just use another lightning. So yeah, we're just not going to do that. Okay. And um, yeah, we're just going to vibe and see what goes on, ladies and gents. Uh, we could just send a little bit of a round 16 rush here though. Yeah, why not? Okay. Just a little bit, just a little bit, boys. And I'm going to end up, oh, I did not mean to upgrade that to a uh, spike bolt, but oh yeah, I see that. I see that. I see that. That camo ceramic in there uh, but we ended up being good against that he had to upgrade that spike ball actually in the back of the map it looked like he leaked a few lives oh and he ends up leaking down to 80 uh but he's gonna be all good okay so i'm gonna try to maybe and i mean maybe actually you know what we probably should play this a little bit safer yeah i'm going to okay he he's most likely going to be sending me a mob on round 18 i am not going to be sending him a mob because i know that that spike ball is going to be able to defend that with ease um, but if he sends us a mob, we should be fine. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna start getting zero zeros actually on the map right now. Uh, but no mob. Okay, so actually, I think we can afford to go for this. And we should be good, okay, because if we need to, we can damage boost. He's gonna give us a well done. Thank you, thank you, thank you. As long as we take this a little bit later than anticipated, we should be able to get through with the dub, okay? Um, I'm gonna boost that, okay? Just to be safe, just to be safe. Uh, I don't wanna just choke to a mob that would be pretty depressing for sure and uh he ended up going for that facility okay so that's that's a risky play that is a risky play indeed is he sending us another rush here no freaking way no freaking way boys i think we're gonna end up being fine against that though we were indeed want to go for this and uh should be able to go for a bfb here in a second and he's got the spike storm that multiple times in order to defend he doesn't have too much money um in general so i'm gonna see what he does here okay he could sell that balloon trap and the spike ball in the back of the map and he could maybe afford uh, but i guess we'll see okay so i kind of don't want to use another damage boost so i'm gonna just end up using a super monkey fan club right there that's gonna give us an easy defend awesome and then we're gonna go for a republic and then a plantation there okay there we go there we go there we go and it looks like he's not gonna end up selling that facility holy crap this guy <laughs> It's nuts! His micro is so freaking quick right there, boys. Oh my gosh. I gotta give props where props are due, boys. Oh my goodness. We have a freaking match here. We have a freaking match here. I wish I would have went the spike battery, though. That freaking sucks, boys. That sucks. Okay, so I'm gonna end up taking the safe route once again here. Not choking anything stupid. I'm gonna end up using the Super Monkey Fan Club there. And that's gonna give us that defend. Okay. And uh, then I'm gonna go for yet another one of these. Kind of maybe when I go for this and oh, I did not mean to upgrade it like that. Okay, so he's going to end up sending us another. So maybe we should actually, dude, he's consistently sending these mobs here. He's getting that constant money from that balloon trap. So he's able to do that. But my goodness. Okay, so I think now if I could find the Super Monkey Fan Club upgrade, I'm going to sell this bad boy and then also sell that to go for another facility that's going to kind of trigger him a little bit maybe he'll send us another mob uh but i think with the dragon breath we should be able to defend without boosting so yeah dude he is right there with us in the farms that is actually nuts <laughs> this guy is freaking nuts boys oh my goodness but the thing is like he loses a lot of money when he has to constantly spike storm so if we have him have to do that constantly then uh, we should be able to get through with the dub um we only have one more damage boost though and we can't take our strategy too late either because we can't defend uh too much with this strategy okay the super monkey fan club only goes so far and then we're gonna need a lot of dragon breath if you want to defend against a lot of zmgs and whatnot so yeah uh, i don't know how to feel about this okay here comes another mob see the thing is he's been like consistently freaking aggressive as well too that's actually nuts boys that's actually freaking nuts so I might just have to send him a ZOMG here, okay? It's going to be pretty hard to fend for him. And I kind of just want to see how he reacts, okay? He's going to send us another mob. Oh my gosh, this guy is insane, boys. This guy is freaking insane. Uh, so hopefully we're good against that. We're going to end up leaking some lives, unfortunately. Uh, but I think we are all good. I got enough, another um, Super Monkey Fan Club up for this round 25 AI. And I'm going to give him a see ya, okay? It's going to be pretty hard to defend. Oh yeah, he's countering. 
Okay. Um, do we try to go through with the defend here? Why not? Why not? You guys are here for content. I'll give you freaking content. Let's go, okay? Let's go right now. All right. Um, I don't think we defend this. I don't think we defend this, boys. Oh my gosh. There's just no way, right? Yeah, there's just no way. He's going to get the dub with the freaking... Oh my gosh. He sent us like so many. Holy crap. He he beat me with my own strategy. He beat me with my... Dude, this guy's a legend. This guy... <laughs> I got to give props where props are due, boys. That, that was a good move, okay? Because I sent the ZOMG. The BFBs are obviously way faster. And he's going to give us a CEO. Yep, yeah, I, I deserve it, man. I freaking deserve it, okay? GG's, man. I told y'all. I am rusty when it comes to this game. We're going to be having it into one more game, though. So I will catch y'all on that. All right, boys. Our last opponent here, Delia Zavala. Doesn't look too good, okay? Uh, so hopefully we can get through with a dub. Um, in honor of the last opponent, we're definitely going to be going with the Spike Factory, okay? That was actually, like, well done. Well done. What I should have done was probably just rush him with BFBs because then he couldn't really counter. I, I can't believe he had that much money. How many BFBs did he send me? It felt like 20, boys. That was in freaking insane. And uh, all he had to do was just defend against the AI, and he was good. I should have sent maybe some BFBs behind it as well, and uh, we probably would have got the dub, okay? All good, though. All good. Um, but yeah, uh, we're just going to be using the Spike Factory also. I think Boomer Spike Factory Farm will be pretty good for this map. So yeah, let's freaking get it, boys. Get it in positive vibes and we shall indeed win. Okay, we're going to be going with our Farmer here. And so it's kind of 50-50 with the strategy. You can either start off with the Boomer or your farm. If you decide to start off with your farm, you're going to be tanking a lot of lives during the early game rounds. If you start off with the Boomer, you'll save a lot of lives, okay? But then you won't be able to get that um, head start on the farms, but we're going to go with the farms because we're greedy. Okay. Um, I feel like this guy also too is going to be a little bit aggressive towards us. And I was right because he's already coming at us with the space blues, which are pretty deadly, not deadly, but like pretty annoying for uh, zero zero boomer. Okay. So we definitely have to get up this, um, binding boomer as quickly as we possibly can. Yeah. He notices that it's working, so he's probably not going to be stopping. Okay, so I'm actually going to glue storm this. Why the freak not? We're already down to 106. So I think that was the go-to play. Uh, so maybe he should have started off with the Bionic Boomer. See, I told y'all. I freaking told y'all. It sucks sometimes to start off with the farm. Um, but once we get this up, we should be good. Oh my gosh, and he timed up the pinks perfectly. This guy's insane. Oh my goodness. I'm actually going to be leaking down. Dude, I have to use another Goose Storm here. Holy crap. He timed those pinks up perfectly. That was actually nuts. That was nuts. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, so I think I'm just going to put this bad boy in close. And uh, hopefully we'll be good with all of those. We're going to finally go for a farm. He is also farming? There's no way. Dude, this guy, this guy's goaded. This guy is freaking goaded, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so maybe now that I think about it, going with the engineer probably would have been a little bit better. It's just a better early game tower overall, too. And you get more money. So if I were to compare Boomer Spike Factory Farm with NG Spike Factory Farm, then yeah. More times than not, I'm going with NG over the Boomer. But it's all good, okay? We forced that double shot upgrade on his side with sending a few sets of space blacks, which is good. We do have a farm lead as well, and I believe that we also have a better power combination. He's also going Ninja Wizard, okay? Which is a noob strategy, okay? Newsflash, if you're new to the game, I know the Ninja and the Wizard, they're very, very good towers by themselves, but together they don't mesh very well, okay? They're pretty expensive, and uh, it just won't get the job done most of the time, okay? So I just would not use that. There are better alternatives, like Boomer's Bike Factory Farm. Okay, this strategy is not that good, but it's fun to use. Uh, also ninja wizard okay so if he's just trying to have fun props freaking props man um by the way i don't even know if i ever said this i did use the super ego boost for the first time i'm always late to it man i, I always am man uh, but he's gonna be sending us quite a bit of yellows here okay so i'm gonna go for a spike factory in the back of the map to hopefully save a few lives because i did not know how many he was gonna send right there that was a lot though uh, but our boomer kind of came in clutch right there so well done boomer well done uh we could easily force an upgrade on the inside if we wanted to with just some space for gem whites but they're also pretty expensive so i guess i'll just save the money because we would have to send quite a bit for sure and i think you already upgraded to that lightning actually so yeah this looks like it's going to be an all-out round 13 kind of game um he is also going to be sending us those mm, do we defend against that we don't die to that right that that's not death that that's not death right holy crap okay so i ended up leaking down to 31 so wasn't death i was right about that but jesus and he just oh <laughs> oh my i'm telling you boys i did not click that there's just no way there I, I wish i could show you my finger placement on that 
I, I didn't click that. I, I did not click that. Okay, so what do we do here? Uh, he's gonna be sending us an all out round 13 rush. Obviously, he already sold all of his towers except for his ninja. Uh, so I'll just sell all of these right here. I'm gonna go for a spike storm and then a boomer. And uh, hopefully, that will be able to actually defend because that was kind of close. That was kind of close, boys. And um, yeah, we should be able to defend against after that. And yep, looks like we're gonna get the dub here. That is gonna be GG. Good try, man. Good try. He gave it an effort. Uh, but you know, we're bolt tricks. We're too freaking good and less. Get it, boys. All right. Feels good. To win with the spike battery ggs only and that is going to be wrapping up today's video holy crap i have not said that in a long time but i hope you guys did in fact enjoy let me know down in the comment section below if you did and also by dropping a like on today's video okay so i don't know what the last question i asked you guys in the last video was so i'm going to check that uh but i'll get back to you in a second so the last question i asked was did you guys think that dart lane spike factory village could be a legitimate strategy i truly forgot that i even did a video on that uh but i believe the answer is yes all right so this guy won congratulations man yeah uh although it's a pretty wacky strategy i feel like it has potential okay so i really forgot about that i'm gonna try to do that maybe in the next couple videos for sure i want to do that again okay so yeah once again though congratulations on the shout out and hopefully you still watch me because it's been a month uh but the next question i'm gonna be asking you guys is are you guys happy that i am back on youtube right there is a right answer for this question okay i know it's weird but yeah make sure so leave your answers down below in the comment section and you may have the chance to win a shout out in the next video, which is obviously dope. I hope you boys enjoy. Once again, it's been your Bobo Tricks or Justin. Peace out, everybody.